are restarting this video because my camera kept turning off. Hi guys. I have a very special guest here with me today. Someone who never wants to show up in my videos because he's a little shy. If you guys don't already know, this is my boyfriend Jerry. We clearly already started on our gingerbread houses. Like I said, we tried using my camera but it wasn't working so we're just gonna pick off, pick up. Pick up where we left off. Exactly. So, um, this is where we're at now. I finally got all four sides of my house up but <clears throat> there are little twinkles but who cares? Yes, who cares? And perfection makes perfection. <laughs> and now my bag as a whole and it's low like it's opening up and the machine is poquito frosty te lo estás acabando no i'm using it as if it was a regular hiking bag, bag. And yeah yeah i knew what you were trying to say wow babe you know all the terms we finish each other's sandwiches <laughs> <laughs> you're so cute that's what i was gonna say i know <laughs> I'm a little sick, so you might be hearing fun coming out of my mouth. Like I had said in the beginning of the other intro, we are not doing the challenge because a lot of people are doing the 15 minute gingerbread house challenge and whoever obviously finishes the gingerbread house within those 15 minutes wins. But we're not doing that because I want to take my time and enjoy making it. And I don't like challenges. I don't like games like that because they make me very nervous. Jerry, on the other hand, loves games. Yes. Is there a specific game that you are really into at the moment? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no particular game right now. What? The one that you were playing earlier. Which one? Don't be embarrassed, babe. Just tell the people what you like. Okay, I was playing a, f a game called Frozen. Frozen? No, you crazy. He likes a farming game. Like planting seeds and harvesting wheat and all these things. Like. Mm hmm. It's called Farming Simulator. The only thing missing is the tobacco too. No, so, that's bad for you. The only thing I need to, to be an actual farmer now. He's a farming man. He is a farmer now. I'm an expert now. You're an expert. Like and you he know was... why? Because video games taught me. Yeah, true. Fun fact, Jerry loves video games. I really like them. I don't... Yeah, yeah, I guess. It's your hobby. Yeah, it's my hobby. Hashtag no shame. Hashtag video game life. Hashtag... Yeah, whenever I, I have a chance, I play hard. I'll play. Which nowadays it's a lot more rare for me to be able to play because of all the things that, that, that that's been happening. Like what? Like the house, work, school. Yes. So it gets a little harder, but whenever I do have time to squeeze it in there, I do squeeze it in there. My hobby is spending time with Jerry. That's a good hobby, babe. <laughs> not everyone gets to do that. It's true, not everyone gets to do that. But <clears throat> it's been very tough um, being able to do a lot of things that are fun. Yeah. Or like a hobby, like for me, it's making these videos for YouTube. It's been a little difficult because, well, one, I started my new job already like three months ago. And uh, two, we've been getting closer and closer to finishing our house. And it, it just, it's, it's a lot. And then Jerry has school, Jerry has work. Not that you have anything to do with my videos because you're just a star right now. I'm a guest. You're a guest star. You know, it's a lot of life things that have been going on and uh, Finally, I got a little chance to make this. I like to really get into the spirit of the holidays. So for Halloween, I've uh, suggested that we make or decorate cookies, and we have before. Um, we usually carve, our pu carve out pumpkins during the, the Halloween, but we didn't get to do that this year. Yes, exactly. We've carved pumpkins two years in a row, and... Uh, Three years in a row. Three years? Oh yeah, 
all three years that we've been together. We've carved pumpkins and unfortunately this year we weren't able to because again, life. But we got a chance to do this. Oh my gosh, I saw that happen. These are really fun to make. I love decorating things like this because you get to spend quality time with your loved ones and do Christmassy things and it's fun. So babe, yes. what is one memory? Did you think about a memory that reminds you or like a Christmas memory that has always stuck by you? No, I didn't think about anything, but I remember you were in the middle of your story right before the camera cut off. So yes. you were saying something about you don't remember it was you or your siblings. I was. So one memory, one childhood memory of uh, Christmas time that I have when we, um, obviously we were little is when my parents got my sister and I bicycles. We got bikes for the first time in our little lives. And uh, we believed in Santa Claus and my parents were making this big deal about, oh, Santa Claus is outside and it was nighttime, it was cold. He's bringing your present. And I don't remember if it was Christmas Eve or Christmas. <laughs> Oh, Sorry. <laughs> oh, stop. Don't hate on my house. Look, it's just, can you guys see that? Like, look at it from there. This is hard and it's messy. Oh yeah, my parents were making a big deal about Santa Claus está fuera y les viene a traer los regalos. So we were super excited. They were keeping us from going outside because I guess they were just like preparing our gifts. And <clears throat> they were they were just telling us like, no, you can't even look out the window, like don't get out of the room, wait until he's ready to like drop off your presents. And in my heart, in my soul, I truly, truly like believed and I was so excited. And I was just thinking like, oh my gosh, he's really here. Like he's here right now. He's outside dropping off our gifts. And I was super excited. And then when my parents like finally released us, <laughs> uh, we went outside or we went to the living room and our gifts were there. And they were bikes. So that's and what you had asked for? I don't remember. But I was super excited. So I was like, oh yeah, baby. You know how to ride a bike or no? I did. You did? I already knew. I was, we weren't that little. We were maybe like seven or eight years old. I don't know, but. It was a, a good night because they took us outside to ride the bikes and we were just there hanging out. I, I really don't have any specific memory. I just remember going to my grandma's house in Mexico. That's where we would spend our Christmas all the time. So that's what I remember when I was uh, doing popping fireworks and that's about it. Like, I just remember the smell of the smoke. The way you make the food, matan and marrano or whatever. Oh yeah. And then, uh, then after that, was lo ponen en un pit, like they make a hole, they they start cooking the pig in that hole, and the smell, I and mean, it's it's a good smell, it's not a bad smell, but that's what I remember, just that smell. And then I remember, okay, one specific one was when I was in fifth grade or fourth grade, uh, we went to Mexico. To, to celebrate Christmas and here it had snowed that year. Oh, remember I remember that. that. I, was, I was in Mexico too. Well, I was in Mexico and I remember being real mad because I, I didn't get to see snow. Because <laughs> I had my cousins here and my aunts. They were like, oh, it's snowed and we got to play snowball fights and I don't know what. And uh, I remember I was real mad. I was like, man, I want order to be here. What, what are we doing in Mexico? Uh -huh. you know? But um, it wasn't even a lot of snow, like it was very little. Um, I still haven't seen snow, have I? It snowed again, like... Yeah, like, but like actual snow, 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 I've never seen actual yeah, snow, I snow. I want to though. Not even when you were little? No, we never went anywhere. Well, my mom says that, yes, but like I don't remember, you know? Yeah, yeah, I remember that year. I was in, we were in Mexico too. And I, I wasn't mad or upset over the fact that we weren't here because of the snow, but I was kind of like disappointed, like, no, I wanted to be there, but yeah. it kind of snowed a little bit over there too. It was just ice. It wasn't really snow, at least in, in, in where I was at. I mean, you could still like, like we were able to go outside and just 
grab like scraps off the grass and oh, make no. little snowballs and just no, throw them at each other. Where we're at. And that's because we were up in the mountain where my grandma lives. It's close yeah. to the to high up over there. And it was real cold. It was just, it, I guess it wasn't raining. So there was no. It wasn't raining enough. Oh my gosh, you're already decorating there? Mm hmm. Wow. I'm just trying to make my house stay. <laughs> I got the skills to pay the bills. You know, in every video that I've seen that people do this, there's always one person's bag that rips and just starts squirting out all this uh, icing. And I've always wondered, like, wow. Or I've always thought to myself, like, wow, that sucks. And what can you do? You're that one. I'm that one. Okay, well, this is what my house looks like so far. I also mentioned earlier that I got us matching pajamas because um, I want these to be our Christmas outfits this year. I had seen them at Target also one of the days that we went just to like, sometimes we go window shopping and I had seen them and I was telling Jerry we should just dress up with matching PJs this year for Christmas. And it was just a thought at the time. There was a bunch of pajamas. It was like before Thanksgiving, before um, Black Friday, before all the things. I was thinking to myself that if we're gonna get them, we should get them now because they, they sell out really quick, especially towards uh, Black Friday. Vito Yecho, they all sold out. Yeah. But I was able to get these online. So I just ordered them on the Target website. And Unfortunately for Jerry, they were out of the men's PJs. So another fun fact. <laughs> yeah, my shirt is a female shirt. And the pants too. Oh yeah, the pants too. Yeah, so I got us both literally matching sets. The same women's pajamas, the same size, the same everything. That's why he's wearing a white shirt under. Yes. So if you guys are wondering why I'm wearing a white shirt under me, it is because of that. <laughs> the shirt was a, li a little bit too small, but it's okay, it looks good. It wasn't a little too small, what are you talking about? It was perfect. Oh, sorry, yeah, it was perfect. What do you want for Christmas this year? Cause I, I got your birthday present, but not your Christmas present. I already told you what I want. What do you want? I, want I know what you want. I know what you want, but these viewers do not know. The people watching your show do not know what you want for Christmas. What are, what is, what do you desire for Christmas? What is your all Christmas? I've asked for this year is a curling iron for my hair and a straightener. Okay, how much is that curling iron? I don't know, but it's the T3 curling iron. I see it all over Instagram. I've seen it. Have you checked reviews on, on Facebook? It? Yeah, I have. And it's good. And yeah, and I've seen, I've seen, I watched videos, reviews on it, and people have been seeing that it's good. And I want to try it. Like, it looks like it makes the the curls in your hair curl. The curl. <laughs> it looks like it, it makes good curls. It is a little pricey, and that's why I'm asking. Oh, oh, oh. That's why I'm asking for it as a Christmas present because. Christmas is when you're when, when you get you're, expensive gifts. When you're allowed to ask for expensive gifts. I when that you, was your birthday. Huh? I thought that then that was for your birthday. Like the being able to ask for expensive gifts. Well that too, for your birthday and Christmas. So when are you not allowed to ask for expensive gifts? The rest of the year. Um, and for me and you, that's literally the, the rest of the years. year. Oh, for the next thirty years. No. Probably. Yeah. With the mortgage that we have now. <laughs> We're officially hashtag adults. This is a lot more tedious than I thought. <laughs> this frosting is like getting to me. Yeah. Oh no, my move! Damn, what you're... do I do? I'm just gonna roll with the punches. This is so hard. Let me open up my candy then. I heard these little treats are really good so i'm Which gonna one? try one the mountain the little trees they taste like green apple uh, they're good 
They're good candies. Mm -hmm. Not not artificial tasting. I can't open this. Yes, I can. I'm a woman. Equal rights, right? Next subject. <laughs> <laughs> Why? That's a controversial subject. No, it's not. Women deserve equal rights. Women. 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 We do. We do. But we still deserve to be treated like queens, too. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Like, if I don't want to go to work tomorrow, you should go to work because I don't want to. <laughs> Cuando te conviene nomás. Mm, never you. Me. Never. never. Strong, independent, and you need no man. Exactly, that is correct. Get it right. Jingle Bell Rock. Jerry loves it when I sing to him. Right, babe? Yeah. Why do you say it like that, Delmer? I'm not saying it like anything. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> you make people think I actually hurt you. Oh, she doesn't. I love you. You're my best friend. Why'd you take off your shirt? Because it got hot. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. Oh no. Not my gumdrop buttons. OMG, mine is falling apart. There we go. You know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! I know the Muffin Man. The one who lived for very late. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, my house is falling apart. Damn, if this would have been a challenge, you would have lost. I would have lost a long time ago. Okay, I'm going to show you guys what I have so far. And it's Falling. Man, and I thought I had my stuff together here. I was like, yes. It's gonna be a piece of cake this. beating Jerry. Huh? That's, right? You're like, it's gonna be a piece of cake beating him. No, I didn't think that, but I didn't think I was gonna have this much trouble. Wow, babe, that looks professional. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be on the show, uh, <clears throat> Sugar Rush, just so you guys know. It's part of my Netflix. <laughs> I have a deal after this. Make sure you watch me. Make sure you watch. <laughs> You're so cute. You Damn. Should. It's a mess. <laughs> what the heck? Babe, I'm so proud of you. You know what yours looks like? <laughs> <laughs> Is it frosty? The snowman? Yeah. <coughs> Stop. It's, it's falling apart. Three, two, one. Timber! Okay. My house lost. It was not a challenge, but my poor house is Take a bite. down. Before I do that, I'm gonna decorate at least the rooftop, one side. Uh, I'm so sad. Officially, how does it feel? To win? To win. Ah, I'm used to it. I win every day. Whatever. Yeah, having you by my side, I'm always winning. Aww. <laughs> so cute. So romantic, right? You're so romantic. So, what shows are you into right now? What, are you, what is it that you're watching? What am I watching? Mm -hmm. I finished watching Box. Merry Christmas Whatever or Merry Whatever Christmas. It is so so freaking funny like it's a really good show but they just premiered it so only one season is on there and i already finished watching the season and it is so good i really recommend it um i also like santa clarita diet i've been watching that one like every time it like a new season premieres and it's so freaking good that show is funny i highly recommend that show that's the one about the girl that comes out and puts the first dates, right? Yeah, Drew Barrymore. What about you, baby? What's your know. favorite show currently? Besides Botched. We've been watching Botched, like, back-to-back -back episodes. But of what's we've been watching the, the, the uh, Netflix version, not the, a, not the E version, right? There's the E version, the American version, no. We were watching the England version. 
Well, England. we watched both. Yeah, but I don't like the American version because it doesn't show the actual, like, when they go in there and they do their thing. It's just like the afterward, or they'll, they'll blur out things in the American one, and that's no fun. Jerry wants to see all the bad, like, yeah, all the blood and ugly all that stuff. stuff, like the gory stuff. Yeah, but because it's interesting, like, that's not if you can't do a show about how procedures get messed up and then not show the procedures being messed up, you know, like okay. lip fillers. I want to see when they cut open the lip and they take out all the gunk. Not just the end result, you know? It's not fun. Okay. You're right. So, this is what I have. I don't know what you did. So, you did awesome, babe. What the heck? This is what I had. That was my entrance. Mine will be on display Yours, from here yeah. to Christmas. Yours is going to be on display from here to Christmas. You see? So, I did us a favor because if mine came out beautiful, we would have to be it um, till Christmas also. And... We wouldn't be able to eat one. I'm just gonna be here eating candies. Almost done, almost done. What? Nothing, I didn't notice when you took it off. Okay, you guys, so I think it's safe to say that we're stopping it here. Unfortunately, my house was a fail, but Jerry's was clearly a great success. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, baby. I'm very Thank proud you. of you. I taught you nothing because you knew it all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was only able to do one side of my roof, but that's okay because now we can leave that one on display, like you said, and we can eat this one. And I'm so excited. You want to try it out? Is it good? It smells like ginger. I can do your bread cooking. Try it. That's really good. I'll tell you what I think it tastes like. Do you really think that this smells like an actual ginger? Ginger root? Uh, I think it's it. cinnamon. Taste it. What's your first impression? Oh wow, tastes like ginger. Tastes like ginger, right? Mm -hmm. Like straight up ginger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so weird. But. Like usually they don't, they taste like cinnamon and that's about it. Yeah, and nutmeg and but all those holiday spices. That actually tastes like ginger. Straight up ginger, like fresh ginger. Yeah. It's good though, I like ginger. ginger. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video as much as we enjoyed making it. Baby, what are you doing? I'm um, just snow. Oh my genius. Hopefully I'm able to upload, edit and upload the rest of the videos of the house really, really soon, sooner than later. I'm going to post this one first though because hashtag holiday season and before Christmas and yeah. Thank you guys. I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye guys. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel. Turn on your post notifications and leave a comment down below. Bye. Okay, this is a close-up of Jerry's gingerbread house. I think they're right the front door. Uh, isn't that the back door? Oh, the front door is a 3D one. Oh, that's true. It looks perfect though. It looks so cute, baby. You did an awesome job. Congratulations. And that's the side. <laughs> okay, cut! <laughs> Thank you.